Hey y'all, uh, uh, sorry this couldn't go first, sorry this video couldn't go first, but I'm going to update you, update you, I want to update you about, uh, about my garden, and sorry, this, this again is tea client, and again, welcome, uh, welcome back, uh, as you can see here, uh, my radishes are doing really well, <clears throat> so are some of my green onions, now, I have placed some store-bought onions in here to regrow, and they are actually, as you can tell, they are coming up, and you have no bloody clue how happy I am about that. I seriously am I seriously am thrilled about that. Now I did plant some more green onions, not the store-bought kind, but the seeds, in in here, and a little in, in a little around here and there. Um, so that way we can have more green onions. I know me and my family will go through them. I know we will. <clears throat> Here's the parsley. This parsley has come up really, really well. Uh, so has the dill. Eventually, I'm, I'm going to have to go back to... <coughs> Pardon me. <laughs> Eventually, I'm going to have to go back to the store to get more sage seeds. Granted, what we have right now is I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying watching the growth of the sage. I'm just realizing the fact that I'm going to have to, because I did double check the bag in which these things, in which the seeds came in, and we have no more seeds left. So at least of the sage. So eventually, at some point, I'm going to have to go back over to probably Walmart and, I, and get more sage seeds. Preferably, they do have the sage over there. <clears throat> I won't lie though. Sorry. I won't lie though, I am wanting to also try maybe growing, maybe, maybe try growing micro greens. I don't know for certain. But in here, we I finally have some rosemary seeds, rosemary growing, at least it looks like it to me. Because they can look like weeds, I know that, so preferably this is not weeds, so preferably this, this, these are not weeds, but actually rosemary growing. Um, my lavender still has yet to show up. My cilantro is doing even. My cilantro is starting to really pop up, and I'm thrilled about that. Um, next up after that, I believe is my mint. That has yet to come popping up. That I believe is my catnip. I don't know. It, and then that one right there. Let me double check to make sure that this is the catnip. Yep, this is the catnip. So that's not really popping up by much, but. Wait until the end of this month to see if they wait until the end of next month to see if they'll pop up. This is chives, that's right. Chives. They have yet my chives. Last year, my chives actually did pop up, so but granted that was during the summertime, so again, wait until the end of next month to see whether or not. <clears throat> and then this is this right here is tarragon. And that is yeah oregano. That I do. I that I think. I think it's popping up. That oh boy, it's raining. Because I am out here right now while it is raining a good amount. Sorry about that, people. Yeah, it is seriously raining a good amount outside here right now. So <clears throat> I am not. Risking my tablet. Yes, you heard me correctly. I use my tablet for my videos. Uh, but right there is, but that right there is my cherry tomato. Are my cherry tomatoes? Which are doing good. And then that right there is my are my beef steak tomatoes. Those two are doing really good. Oh man, that. Ah, sorry, people. Sorry, I keep forgetting about that little spot right there. <clears throat> Oh my lands. But yeah, it is. It's not downpouring like it was earlier. It's a good size drizzle, I won't lie. But uh, yeah, welcome to Indiana weather. <laughs> First, you get chilly, then you get warm, and then you get can get a mixture of, of uh, rain slash sleet or something of the sort. And you, as you can see right there, the wind is 
very much is kind of picking up a little bit. Um, that this right here, I have chosen to use as well as you can tell a rain catcher, so that way uh, I don't have to continue using my <clears throat> the so that way I don't have to continue on going back and forth getting water from our kitchen sink because most of the time I just want to do, but. I am using this as a rain catcher to catch all the water so that way I can at least use this once in a while, use the water in here to do that and just save myself some good amount of trips. Well, <clears throat> hope you're having a great day. Hopefully it's not as drizzly and as wet and as somewhat dreary as what it is here in Indiana. Well, you all have a, a great week, great rest of the week, and have a great uh, Memorial Day weekend. Love you all, and have fun with all your family, all your family members and friends, and have a great time with the barbecues, if that's what you're planning to do. I know a lot of people do that. Uh, again, like I said, love you all, and God bless. Bye.